two, one, opting in. Thank You're you. live with Lucy Hawkins on BBC World News. Number of people who drowned after a migrant boat capsized off the Italian coast continues to rise. Out of At least 62 people have died, including 12 children, after their boat broke apart in rough seas, having sailed from Turkey. Nigeria. Q. A significant victory for the third party candidate in Nigeria's election, Peter Camera Obi, four, taking Camille most X. votes in Lagos State. Election results are still coming in. And four. The British Keep Prime Minister is preparing to meet the European Commission chief in the next hour. They're thought to be very close to a deal on post-Brexit trade arrangements for Northern Ireland. Drought. And France Keep is facing its driest winter in more than 60 years. Not a drop of rain has fallen in the past month, and it has farmers and scientists worried. And three. In the next half hour, we'll be live in Sicily, Belfast and Westminster. And running titles. Up to the catwalk we go. Coming to the wide shot, all the wide, through to three, Q Lucy. At least 62 people trying to reach Europe are known to have drowned after their boat sank in rough seas off southern Italy. Twelve children, we think, as well, including a baby and young twins, are among the dead. The Coast Guard said 80 people have been found alive, including some who managed to swim ashore. But it's believed as many as 60 are still actually missing. Now, their vessel broke apart when they were trying to reach a seaside resort in Klatone. It's thought the boat uh, left From Izmir, frame, which is in next. eastern Turkey. That was three days ago. Uh, rescue workers say, though, the boat was incredibly overloaded. Possibly up to 200 people were on board. Vincent McKevney has more. 